Hi there, welcome back. Another little mini episode of MacGyver's Workshop here as we make uh, ever so slow progress on our house building project. We're at the boring stage of things now where we're doing all the little nitnoid stuff that takes a lot of time and it's, you know, it's not really like doing cool stuff, you know, but uh, it's got to be done and to be done right, so. Let me show you what we've gotten done so far anyway. I'll turn the camera around here. Okay, so we've got we've got all the trenches filled in all the way. And uh, i got to let them settle. So they'll probably be about two or three times of me filling them in. You know, and uh, then grading it out and then filling them in again. That sort of thing throughout the summer. And then uh, once that happens, then by winter time, you know, I won't have three telltale, you know, divots in the in the field there. So, but it's, uh, you know, it's a get there. It's just going to take time. Can't rush that. So, well, hi, Mufasa. Here's my little, my little brave kitty. What are you doing? You're not spoiled, are you? No, not you. Yeah. So the same thing really on this side of the drive on the side of the driveway. <laughs> Actually, really surprised that uh, I got the the driveway part to where it's not settling in. But I think that's to do with all the gravel. So with the dirt here, every time it rains, it just packs in. And, but uh, the main thing we got done was. Uh, we got our electrical done inside and wiring all the boxes up and all that and then we got the uh, finally I was able to get the uh, geothermal loop lines run in they're all run into the through the foundation and up into the uh, uh, utility room there. We got it kind of mocked up to where the uh, you know where everything's going to go and and uh, we have to do that. Have to have every, everything kind of roughed in for the framing inspection. Then once once we get past that then we finish everything out and you know make everything pretty and then they come in for the final. So we're getting there. Uh, it's too dark in there right now to take any video. It's about eight o'clock now, so I'll uh, I got some pictures uh, posted on Facebook earlier. I'll inject those into the video here so you can see them. Well, and starting to get some of the excess mess cleaned up, you know, get ready for the, get ready to have the brick delivered. I've ordered it, I had it ordered, uh, you know, and waiting, they're waiting on me to give them the word to deliver it, but it's been raining so much, they can't get their lift into or a little forklift thing around the, to set the bricks all around the house because I sure as heck ain't going to carry them from one end of the house to the other so so we just have to wait until we get a good dry spell and then they come drop them all off so but and then I got to load all these up these are all the leftover 12 inch block from the foundation take them back swap them out for eights so we can then that's when we'll start laying them down in there in the remainder of the foundation or the footer and uh, use the 8 inch block to get up to where the you know the ground level is going to be 
and then uh, break from there. So but we're getting there slowly but surely. So thanks for watching, and stay tuned for next time. Bye.